Prince Harry has produced the show with U.S. chat show host Oprah Winfrey, who carried out the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's first tell-all interview since stepping down as senior members of the royal family. The new program, titled The Me You Can't See, aired during the early hours of Friday morning and saw Harry criticize the royal family, accusing them of total neglect. The Duke of Sussex will further discuss the new mental health documentary on Good Morning America today, which could see the royal make further inflammatory accusations. Omid Scobie, who co-authored the Sussex's biographer Finding Freedom, spoke of Harry's upcoming appearance on the show on Twitter. He wrote, as some of you have already seen, Prince Harry will be joining GMA tomorrow, May 21st, to talk exclusively about hashtag the me you can't see, the brand new Apple TV series he executive produced with Oprah. The show runs between 7 to 9 a.m. Eastern Time, which will be 12 to 2 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time. Harry is expected to be quizzed on many of the claims made in the series, which sees the royal open up about his mental health, past traumas and experience of therapy. In the new interview, Harry said he and his wife were followed, photographed, chased and harassed from the very start of their relationship. Despite the immense media interest in the couple, the Duke claimed they received little support from the firm to counter the verbal attacks. He told Oprah, I felt completely helpless. I thought my family would help. But every single ask, request, warning, whatever it is, just got met with total silence or total neglect. We spent four years trying to make it work. We did everything that we possibly could to stay there and carry on doing the role and doing the job, but Meghan was struggling. He said the way his wife was feeling reminded him of his mother's final days. Harry said, history was repeating itself. My mother was chased to her death while she was in a relationship with someone who wasn't white. And now look what's happened. It's incredibly triggering to potentially lose another woman in my life. Like, the list is growing. And it all comes back to the same people, the same business model, the same industry. Harry also revealed he was willing to take drugs as a young adult to feel like I was feeling, as he struggled to come to terms with his mother's death. He described being aged 28 to 32 as a nightmare time in my life, in which he had panic attacks and severe anxiety. Harry said, I was willing to drink. I was willing to take drugs. I was willing to try and do the things that made me feel less like I was feeling. The Duke of Sussex ISNT the only well-known face to appear on the new mental health documentary. Other celebrities include singer Lady Gaga, Olympic boxer Virginia Fuchs and celebrity chef Richard Armstead.